Whispers of the obsidian claw. Jade, the solid black cat, lounged atop the old fisherman's crate near the docks. Her belly sagged, testament to her love for sunspots and sardines. Gizmo, the adventurous calico, perched on the nearby barrel, her eyes scanning the horizon. Jade, Gizmo said, her voice a whisper, have you ever wondered what lies beyond the waves? Jade blinked her round eyes. Beyond the seagulls and fishing boats? Why bother, Gizmo? Life is cozy here. But Gizmo's tail twitched with anticipation. There's a museum on the edge of town, a place of relics and forgotten tales. Legends say it guards an ancient secret, a tunnel that leads to realms untold. Jade's plump body stirred. You mean like in those adventure games? Gizmo nodded. Exactly, but for real. And we're going to find it. The Maple Street Museum stood like a sentinel, its wood walls etched with history. Jade and Gizmo slipped inside, their paws silent on the wooden floors. Dusty artifacts lined the walls, cracked faces, faded paintings, and statues with eyes that seemed to follow them. Gizmo led Jade to a dimly lit corner. There, behind a velvet rope, stood a massive coffin. Its lid bore intricate carvings. Near it was a serpent coiled around an obsidian claw. Jade's heart raced. Could this be the entrance? Gizmo pressed her paw against a hidden panel, and the coffin shifted. With a crumbled hole, revealing a narrow staircase leading downward. Jade hesitated, but Gizmo's eyes glowed with determination. Come on, Jade, Gizmo urged. The tunnel twisted, its walls etched with symbols from lost civilizations. Jade squeezed through tight spaces, her black fur absorbing ancient energy making her thin and agile. Gizmo's calico patches glowed as they descended deeper. They emerged into a vast chamber. Torches flickered, illuminating a treasure trove, golden coins, jeweled crowns, and mysterious scrolls. But the true wonder lay at the far end, a shimmering portal, swirling with colors Jade had never seen. Gizmo grinned. This is it, Jade. The gateway to other worlds. Jade glanced back at the museum, at the life she'd known. Then, with a leap of faith, they jumped through. The air crackled, and she found herself in a jungle, ancient ruins, vines, and danger lurking in every shadow. But the biggest mystery awaited, the purpose of the obsidian claw. Was it a weapon? A key? Or something darker? As they ventured onward, Jade and Gizmo knew one thing. Legends whispered their names. They were no longer mere cats. They were explorers and guardians of secrets. The jungle swallowed Jade and Gizmo, its ancient trees towering overhead. Their paws sank into moss-covered earth as they followed the winding path. The air hummed with magic, and the scent of adventure clung to their fur. Gizmo's eyes gleamed. Jade, we're in a labyrinth, a puzzle of shadows and secrets. Each turn could lead us deeper or trap us forever. But why are we here? What's the Obsidian Claw's purpose? Jade asked. Gizmo's tail flicked. Legends say it grants immense power, a power that could reshape worlds. But it's guarded by trials. We must prove our worth. And so, they ventured forth. Glyphs whispered warnings, and statues shifted when they weren't looking. Gizmo deciphered riddles etched into stone, while Jade triggered hidden mechanisms. Jade hesitated. Gizmo, which way? Gizmo's eyes narrowed. The fiery path tests courage. The icy one, resilience. Choose wisely. Jade's plump belly quivered. She remembered sunspots and sardines, not fire and ice. But Gizmo's adventurous spirit tugged at her. Fire, Jade decided. We'll face the flames. They stepped into the chasm. Heat enveloped them, flames dancing along the walls. Jade's fur singed, but she pressed on. Gizmo's calico patches shimmered, her determination unwavering. At the heart of the inferno stood a pedestal, a single obsidian claw. Jade's breath caught. Was this it? Gizmo read the inscription, to claim power, sacrifice what you hold dear. Jade glanced at Gizmo. What do we sacrifice? Gizmo's eyes softened. Our fears, Jade. Our doubts. Our cozy lives on Maple Street. Together, they placed their paws on the claw. Fire surged, consuming their insecurities. Jade's plumpness melted away, leaving a sleek form. Gizmo's patches glowed brighter, her spirit unburdened. The flames subsided, revealing a portal, a swirling vortex. Beyond it lay realms uncharted, mysteries waiting to be unraveled. Gizmo grinned. Ready, Jade? Jade's heart raced. Nope, but let's go. They stepped through, leaving the fiery labyrinth behind. The portal spat them out onto a deserted island, waves crashing against rocky cliffs. Ancient ruins loomed, 
A city lost to time. Gizmo's tail twitched. Our next adventure awaits, Jade. The Obsidian Claw's power is ours to wield. Jade and Gizmo had traded comfort for destiny. They were no longer mere felines, they were legends in the making. And so, under the island's twin moons, they set forth, their paws leaving imprints on the sands of time. The deserted island was a tapestry of forgotten magic. Jade and Gizmo explored crumbling temples, their paws brushing against ancient inscriptions. The air hummed with secrets, and the twin moons cast eerie shadows on the moss-covered stones. Gizmo led her to a moonlit pool, its surface rippling. Look, she said. The reflections, their memories. Jade peered into the water. Images danced, a sorcerer chanting, a lost queen weeping, and a clawed hand reaching for power. The obsidian claw's history unfolded. Gizmo's voice trembled. The claw was forged by the ancients, beings beyond time. It grants dominion over elements, fire, ice, earth, and more. Jade's heart raced. But why hide it here? Gizmo's gaze turned grave. Because power corrupts. The ancients feared its misuse. They scattered its shards across realms. Jade remembered the fiery chasm and icy darkness. We've only seen two elements. What about the rest? Gizmo pointed to the moonlit pool. The reflections reveal paths. We must find the other shards, balance the elements. And so, they embarked on their quest. Through enchanted forests, where trees whispered forgotten spells. Across desert dunes, where sandstorms guarded secrets. Beneath ocean depths, where mermaids sang of lost cities. Each shard brought trials. Jade faced flames that licked her sleek form, while Gizmo braved blizzards that threatened to freeze her spirit. They deciphered riddles, battled guardians, and grew stronger. Finally, they stood before the last shard, a crystal cavern. Its walls shimmered with rainbow hues. Jade's paw touched the shard, and memories flooded her of sunspots, sardines, and Maple Street. Gizmo's eyes softened. Jade, we must choose. Power or home? Jade remembered her cozy life, the warmth of sunspots, the taste of sardines. But she also remembered the thrill of adventure, the bond with Gizmo. Home, Jade said. Maple Street. Gizmo nodded. Let's go. They placed the shard in the obsidian claw. The cavern trembled and opened, a portal to Maple Street. As they stepped through, Jade felt her plumpness return. Gizmo's patches glowed less fiercely. They stood with the museum behind them. Maple Street remained unchanged the seagulls, the docks. But Jade and Gizmo were different. They had been to lands beyond, held power in their paws. And Maple Street? It remained blissfully unaware, its secrets guarded by two unlikely heroes. Thank you. Please like and subscribe for more.